It makes sense. People hoping to get the all clear before family gatherings. But our Juliet Goodrich tells us that these tests could lead to a false sense of security. Juliet. Well, you know, we keep hearing get tested if you've been exposed. Well, a lot of people are trying to get tested before the holidays. Places like CVS and test sites in the county are available, but they are jammed up with people. And even if you take that test, it doesn't mean you're in the free and clear come Thanksgiving week. Karma Chang and her two sons got their COVID test today in the CVS drive through line. No, we just wanted to, before the holidays, just make sure we were healthy um, and we plan to just stay with our own family. But securing appointments meant booking them at the strike of midnight and even then there was no guarantee. You had to go on at midnight three days before to book your appointment. If you waited till that morning, you weren't going to get an appointment. Or there is the hours long wait at the Alameda County Fair where testing was done by 10 a.m. because they had already reached a 500 patient limit. So testing should be ubiquitous. That should be a major priority of the new administration to make testing as widely available as possible. Dr. George Rutherford is an epidemiologist with UCSF and has this holiday health warning to those who have already been tested. But to just get a single test and say, okay, now we can bring the kid back from college in, you know, in Wisconsin and, uh, you know, have him meet up with his grandmother on Thanksgiving for six hours with no masks on. Not a good thing. You need to be really careful about those sorts of situations. This is our bubble. <laughs> <laughs> We're staying home and uh, staying uh, safe. And so the Hernandezes plan to spend their Thanksgiving with a table set for two, even though their children and grandchildren live nearby. We're just going to see our kids uh, over Zoom probably or just talk to them over the phone and our grandkids also. And that's it. We're just going to have Thanksgiving by ourselves. Yeah. So the woman you had uh, before her was talking about a, a you know a three day wait to get an appointment. How soon are people getting their results back? Well, Ken, I know you've been tested. I've been tested. It takes 24 to 48 hours to get your results back, and that's the case here at CVS and at the Alameda County Fairgrounds. And when you do get your test back, you still need to stay in that bubble and still take precautions beyond that, especially next week.